We see Omicron in retreat and, uh, and we begin the road of trying to find the, all the best ways to learning to live with COVID. And today I'm particularly pleased to announce that we'll be removing a huge number of restrictions that were put on care homes during the Omicron crisis. And from Monday, care homes will be able to have unlimited number of visitors and will also be significantly cutting the self-isolation period. And again, we're able to do all this because of our, the success of our vaccination program. And I would draw just urge everyone who still hasn't come forward for whatever reason, for whether it's their first jab, their second or their third, please do come forward, protect yourself and your community. At, at the local level, there is a lot of discretion. And I think that is right uh, because a, a, you know one care home may have, for example, a, a lot of positive cases. Another may have none. So there's a lot of discretion giving to the managers of care homes and they will work with their local public health uh, officials in that region. And it's right. And, and nationally, though, we will provide the guidance and anything else they need, such as all the testing, uh, you know, tests that they might need, whether it's PCR tests, a lateral flow test and any other support that they I, I, I would just urge all care homes to do everything they can uh, to, to allow as many visitors as they can. Now, as I say, from Monday, in terms of national rules, there will be no restriction on the number of visitors. If a care home needs to act a bit differently because of an outbreak, then that is understandable as long as they are doing everything they can to allow the maximum number of visitors.